Well, um, like, explain a little bit how, how it works in the classroom. So, like, you know, is it is it a, you know, you get a, you know, you get an A on the test and, 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 and you get a card, or is it, or what, what are the sort of, uh, how do you use the incentives? So we, it's kind of twofold for us. Number one, um, we use an app called Class Dojo, um, which, hey, you came to class prepared today, you're on time, you get three, four, five points. And then once a month, our assistant, our assistant principal kind of uh, leads this whole thing up. Um, and if you have 150 points, you can buy either a Pokemon pack, uh, MLB pack, an NFL pack, or a NBA pack. And so then um, they can go down and use those points that they've earned throughout the week to earn cards. And then um, we're all donated based. So every card we used has been donated to our school. Um, so then all those cards that have been donated, some of them um, – my principal didn't want to pack. I mean, I'm not going to lie to you. We had over 150,000 cards donated so far to our school. Whoa! Um, yeah. Um, so some of them, he just didn't have the time to get packed, or um, the kids wouldn't know them, that sort of stuff. So then we just have those cards. If um, we see a kid doing something good in the hall, we just go and give them a card right there on the spot to add to their collection. Um, so, yeah, it's kind of twofold. They earn it over a period of time, or it can just be doing something – right in the school day and they just get a card right on the spot i imagine like like a, like a newer pack like that's the that's 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 yeah. a, that's a, a high value reward a lot of points in the class dojo to, to earn yeah. that versus yep. the, the the random card you get for you know flushing the toilet or whatever yeah <laughs> yeah um, um yeah, Joe, no, what grade are you again what, what grade do you teach um i teach fifth and sixth grade um ela and social studies I, I have a sixth grader right now. My, my heart goes out to you. <laughs> it's, it's a jungle. Yeah. It's a jungle. It's yeah, they're they're fun, but but man, they can be challenging. Um, I'm bald, so if that tells you anything about my lifestyle, you know. <laughs> <I'm> like, <laughs> I get the gray to show my my age. Um, so so tell me about like you know, all right. So 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 do your students like? Did they have they been coming to you with this question that my, my kids are coming to me with, which is like. Hey, Mr. Hoogland, how do I figure out what my card's worth? Like, I just, you know, like David was just ripping those baseball cards or like, I just, uh, you know, got this card. Do I, how do I, how do I know if it's like any good? Um, so prior to um, winter break, no, not really. They were just more excited to have them. After winter break, when I found the Collects app and I told, um, told my students about it, now at recess every day, I am literally just scanning cards all of recess <laughs> <laughs> to tell them what the value of their cards are. So, oh, really? Okay. Yeah. So prior to winter break, uh, I, I mean, guess I'm sorry. <laughs> or, what was that? You're sorry? welcome. Yeah. I don't know if <laughs> yeah. I should say I'm sorry or you're welcome. Uh, I mean, either way, you know what? It gets me interacting with them more. So. Yeah. So, um, but you're the, the, the cards that you were scanning into your, your account, right? So when for everyone's benefit, Joel, let me see. I'm going to show you Joel's account here. Oh, uh, Sorry, a little clumsy here with the uh, the demo. I was uh, um, Joel has I think four almost five thousand cards in his account. Um, that's a lot of cards, right? And these were mostly cards that uh, did you say you got them from your dad? Like, yeah, we found them in uh, my dad's old closet at his grandparents. All right, my grandparents, his parents. And that, what's the breakdown like? So it's. Uh, 2000 baseball, but like 2600 uh, football, so more football than baseball. Yep. Um, your dad was more of a, and what, what did your dad, you know, did your dad have a favorite team? Or, um, uh, we're all pretty big Minnesota everything fans. So twins, Vikings, all that. Got it. Well, this is great. Any, any particular cards that, you know, you want to, you want to call out as like ones that you think are, that, that were pretty cool when you were, when you were scanning in the collection? Um, it's actually kind of more funny. My girlfriend is telling me I need to tell these stories. The cards I couldn't scan in were the better ones. Um, my dad had a Terry Bradshaw card, um, that he decided to change the name of Terry Bradshaw on the card to, I don't even remember to what he wanted it to be the current Steelers quarterback. And I mean, this was at the time he was like eight years old. So he didn't have any idea at that point. Wait, oh, you're saying you couldn't, you, couldn't sc you couldn't scan the Terry Bradshaw card in because he he, 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 uh, he wrote on it? Good. Yeah, he defaced it pretty good. Oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> so that one was pretty funny. Um, 
there were a couple other ones. He had a John Elway rookie card that we now can't find back. So that that's another fun one that couldn't scan it in. Um, he had an OJ Simpson card. That one was pretty fun. I don't know. I think Hannah, did you scan that one in? Yeah, Hannah scanned that one, and it should be in there um, somewhere. Great. Would it show, would it show up as OJ Simpson, or would it show up as uh... – let me try searching just Simpson. Pretty sure it got scanned in. Maybe not. A lot of well, a lot of Simpsons, I guess, right? <laughs> it was it <a> Joe Simpson <laughs> for twenty? That was another fun one too. I guess I don't know. <laughs> um, cool. Yeah. No. So I don't know a lot of his cards. Uh, once I saw we were running a. Uh, you guys were running a giveaway. We just started scanning like crazy. That's that's awesome. Oh, so you did know about the contest. But we did. Know, yeah. Brett was like, hey, Brett had no idea that we were doing anything. He was well, like, I just I did not first because I was going through the whole look them up online, put them in a spreadsheet, and then it popped up as a suggested follow on Twitter, and that's how I got started. really yeah collected. Yeah, that's crazy. Wow. You know, it's so funny how people find us. Like we 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 had a ton of people find us on Twitter last Friday. We had a um, there was a tweet that went out um, from a guy named Darren Ravel, and we got a ton of users off Twitter. But it's 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 just kind of random, right? You know, yeah. who knows? Maybe tonight we'll get a lot of users off Instagram. Um, you never know what's where people are going to find you. It's funny. Um, so David, you're muted right now. Are you? I don't know if you're talking. Sorry, yeah, I was, I was saying something. Um, my bad. Uh, we got we got a uh, a question from Jason, Vintage B-ball. Uh, b-ball cards it says what card value surprised you the most joel when you cool. scanned i don't know maybe it was the ones that came in the least like names that i knew from like my dad talking about growing up and then you scan them in and they really had no value i guess that was kind of maybe the bigger thing for me when my dad was like oh you should scan this card he was really mm -hmm. good growing up and then we scanned it in and it was like 25 cents yeah, I mean, what I was talking about with uh, Joel a few minutes ago, uh, I mean, sorry, Brett a few minutes ago, we're adding a ton of historical pricing, a ton, like, you yeah. know. Um, so I think our pricing will get better. You know, you'd just be able to go back in the app, refresh it and see it. Um, it's it's just a matter of just, you know, finding a lot, a lot, a lot of transactions on eBay and other sites. So um, hopefully that should get better. I mean, you know, it is it is always funny, like, too, some of the older cards don't get transacted that much, right? Yep. So if you don't have a recent, you know, comp to, to base it on, um, sometimes you're, you're, you're just estimating. Um, so we're, we're trying to work on better ways to estimate, too. But, um, but yeah, that's definitely the case. I think, you know, I think we, we really cut our teeth on, on baseball. So I think our baseball pricing's pretty solid. Um, still getting better, but football, we're uh, – we're doing a lot of work on right now to try to get it to the same place.